What's up guys, welcome back to yet another review video. So it's been a long time OnePlus have rolled out Android 12 second stable build for OnePlus 8, 8 Pro, 8T and OnePlus 9R. So I've used this device for almost 3-4 days and will cover almost everything like general stability, battery drain, heating issues, camera part and the performance part. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. So here you can see this is my OnePlus 8 on which I am running Oxygen OS 12 stable build which was the second stable build for OnePlus 8 series and 9R and the version was C.15. So as always we created a poll asking you guys about what all topics we need to cover in the review video and the maximum votes were given to performance and battery segment. So we'll cover that also in the later part of the video. But let me mention you guys few bugs which I have faced while using the device as my primary phone. And basically if I have to say anything about this latest build, trust me guys this is one of the finest build of Android 12 which we have received on OnePlus 8 series. And the reason behind that is the stability part, decent battery backup and improvement in the camera. So once we created the poll, many users had the issue of battery and performance. So that also we'll be talking about. As you can see, I have all the screen on times and the issues which I have faced, I have taken the screenshot of that too. So one of the first issue which I noticed on my device, you can see the entire UI was completely messed up. I don't know what happened, but this bug I only encountered once. Here you can see, I tried fixing clearing all the reasons and nothing happened. So to fix this, I had to restart my device and after that I did not face any such issues. And guys, these are very minor issues. On the previous builds, we used to see lot many messages regarding Gmail notification but almost 99% of times I do get Gmail notifications with no issues on this current build. And guys, before moving further, let's keep a like target of 500 likes on this video and still we have 82% of users who haven't subscribed to our channel so if you find our videos helpful to you do consider subscribing and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video talking about the next bug which i encountered on my oneplus 8 running oxygen os 12 second stable build is related to instagram so here instagram keeps crashing and i have also seen few users reporting the same issue and that happened for me also it doesn't happen always but most of the times it do happen and by the way guys thank you so much for your awesome support we have completed 80k subscribers on our youtube channel and now let's complete 3k subscribers on our instagram too link of the instagram can be found in the description below so instagram was the second bug which i have encountered while using oneplus 8 as a primary phone also noticed bit of issues with the blue Bluetooth services. So this also happens almost all the time when I use my Realme Buds Air 2. I personally feel that's an issue with the Buds because when I try to use other Buds, I don't face any issues. But if any one of you guys are using Realme Buds Air 2 with your OnePlus 8 series, then let me know while gaming, do you face any kind of disconnection issues? And there's another screenshot or I can say video recording which I did and this happens when my device is bit heated up so there are bit of jitters while scrolling down the quick setting panel or while opening up the app drawer and this usually happens when the device is bit heated up when the device temperature is normal i don't find any kind of issues in the ui and the max temperature what i have noticed on my oneplus 8 series after this latest update was around 44 degrees celsius and this also happens with the normal usage without any kind of gaming okay so these were some of the issues related to stability and talking about the battery drain and battery backup guys yesterday i made a video on how can you fix the battery drain caused by quick device connect application the video is being displayed on the screen make sure to check out that video that will fix all the heating issues and the battery drain issues on your any oneplus smartphone now let's also talk about the battery backup which i have been getting on my oneplus 8 we'll also show you the charging speed because most users have been complaining that charging speed have decreased on oneplus 8 series after this update so this is the first cycle where you guys can see i've got 4 hours 43 minutes of screen on time with my normal usage and guys all these battery backups or you can say screen on times are with always on display turned on along with power saving mode enabled under always on display this is the second battery cycle again you can see i got almost five hours of screen on time with my normal usage and if you see the graph there are no issues related to quick device connect application which most of the oneplus users have been facing and talking about overnight battery drain you can see when i went to sleep the battery percentage was 19 percent and when I woke up in the morning around 8 o'clock the battery percentage was 12 so we only saw 7% of battery drain and at last now let me show you the 
charging speed. So we started charging a device at 9 2 in the morning and around 10 8 my device was completely charged to 100%. So it took almost 1 hour and 6 minutes. To cross check the charging speed test we again did the same thing when the battery percentage was 10% and the time was 8.28 when I connected the charger or when I kept the device for charging at sharp 9.31 charging was complete wherein device only took 1 hour 3 minutes to completely charge on Oxygen OS 11 my device used to take around 55-57 minutes to completely charge yes slight improvements are required in the charging speed 5-10 to 10 minutes difference doesn't matter in daily usage so overall if I had to say anything about the battery backup for me battery backup seems to be really good on my OnePlus 8 and for users who are facing issues with the battery day make sure to watch the video which is being displayed on the screen that will help you fix battery drain and overheating of the device and now let's move on to the camera part so guys basically i personally don't have any kind of complaints related to the camera segment because i did not see any kind of improvements over the previous update the picture quality remains same in normal lighting conditions pictures are good enough overexposure is bit controlled if you are clicking pictures using front camera in portrait mode but there are no major improvements compared to initial build of oxygen os 12 color production seems to be good enough decent enough i would say not that great Overall OnePlus haven't improved anything much when it comes to camera segment on Oxygen OS 12. We still do see lot of color shifting while switching between the lenses and which is one of the major drawback OnePlus smartphones. It's not only with OnePlus 8 series, on almost all OnePlus smartphones including OnePlus 9 and OnePlus 10 Pro, we have been seeing too much of color shifting when switching between different lenses. One thing which I'm really impressed about this particular update and that's picture clicked in low light condition so guys on previous updates i've been covering camera segment on almost every build and on this specific build i have noticed bit of improvement in the nightscape photography still on oneplus 9 we don't see much of difference between the pictures clicked in normal mode and nightscape mode but here you can take a look at the pictures there's lots of difference now pictures are more brighter with lesser noise and we also get to see more details if we click pictures in the nightscape mode or you can say low lightning condition so here only good part of this particular build is nightscape photography have been improved a bit compared to the previous builds so this one thing i'm really happy about when it comes to camera and now at last let's also talk about the gaming part so guys there are no options to enable 90 fps in games like battlegrounds mobile india as you all know i have been into gaming from a long time and basically i play bgmi a lot every day i spend three to four hours playing battlegrounds mobile india on specifically oneplus 8 series we do get the option of smooth and 90 fps but in the games or you can say gameplay we only get to see 60 fps and we are okay if we also get 60 fps but here you can see in the lobby itself device delivers 55 54 53 and it doesn't go above that and when we start to gaming there are lot many issues when it comes to frame drops in normal tdms also i haven't seen the device goes above 55 fps and fps is not at all constant being such high-end device i think oneplus should focus on such things i also tried different games but they're also same scenario initially i used to think it's a issue with battlegrounds mobile india but now almost on all oneplus devices including oneplus 10 pro the fps while playing battlegrounds mobile india doesn't go above 55 so here a major drawback i have tested gaming in high performance mode and even with the game space application i always use performance mode still there are no improvements to be seen oneplus smartphones were known for its best performance when it comes to gaming but since the oxygen os 12 have been released the performance while gaming have really gone down lot many frame drops heating issues excessive battery drain and i think oneplus will take some more time to fix all these issues on few devices we do get the support of 90 fps in the game but actually in real life while gaming and 90 fps is not being delivered by the device and previously we had already made few videos in which we were able to trigger 90 fps forcefully but now on Oxygen OS 12, that's not the case. Now we cannot enable 90 FPS using any command. You can say ADB commands. Just wait for a few more days. Let's see if OnePlus is going to fix this issue or not. And I'll also be creating a poll on OnePlus forum. So if you guys are the one who are into gaming and wants 90 FPS on your device, then make sure you guys go and vote in that section. Once I create that poll, I'll drop that link in the description below of this video or on our Telegram channel. So guys, this was my complete review 
W on Oxygen OS 12 second stable build for OnePlus 8 series. Overall, no issues with the build. There are slight heating issues and battery drain which users have been facing and that can be easily fixed. So to fix that, just watch the video given in the description below and you'll have no excessive battery drain or overheating of the device. Overall, when it comes to general performance, OnePlus 8 seems to be doing good with this second stable of Oxygen OS 12. And if I have missed out anything, you guys let me know in the comment section below. This is your friend Ashok signing out. See you guys in the next video.